Okay, in this question, uh, we have a rectangle, and we're given one of the sides and the diagonal, um, and we're asked to find the other side, so length CD. Um, now, we can see straight away we've got a right angle triangle here, and we know two sides, and we want a third, that means Pythagoras. Um, so, I wouldn't normally do it this way, but this is a good way to remember it, to think about it, which is, this is the general shape of Pythagoras, it's something squared plus something squared equals something else squared, and the one that's on its own, on the right there, is always the hypotenuse. So that one is the hypotenuse, it's opposite the right angle, um, which means that the other two, on the left, 10 and x. Um, so then we simply square the numbers that are there, so 10 squared is 100, plus x squared equals 17 squared, which is 289, and this is just an equation now to solve. We want to get x on its own. So the first thing is to get rid of the 100 by subtraction. So subtract 100 from both sides. We have x squared is 189. And finally, as is always the case with Pythagoras, the last step is going to be to square root. So x is the square root of 189. And that comes to uh, that comes to 13.7477 dot 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 dot. Uh, we want the answer to one decimal place. Okay, so we're going to round that to 13.7, and the units are centimetres. Um, remember, of course, to do a bit of a common sense check, check that it all makes sense. Um, 13 and a bit centimetres, it, it, it fits, doesn't it? Because it's less than 17, um, which is what it should be with the hypotenuse, but it's about the same size as the other short side.